Elizabeth. I am still waiting on this show. It's supposed to be coming back at the end of this year. So if you like historical like shows like Bridgerton, but this more raw, real and like dark, you know, it's like so, so good. Like, so if you haven't watched it, go check it out on Netflix or after you hear this, then you can go and watch it because I'm not going to spill everything. So just imagine you looking at your man on Tinder and y'all supposed to be meeting up, you know, this has happened to her sister in the red dress. OK, she was supposed to be marrying France. OK, the queen picked her. She come to the castle and thinking that she's about to begin married to this man. But the man see the sister and was like, oh, I want Elizabeth. That's who I want. But my whole thing is like, France got a whole side chick. This is the side chick right here. And she already knows that he's about to be married. But she ain't trying to let this man go because this man got money. Okay, this man got money. He paying for, you know, her livelihood. So she's not really trying to let this man like go. Okay, she got bills to pay. So she's not about to let france go Thing doesn't bend it must break why always the finest dudes be having like the craziest moms okay like france mama is the duchess and she is crazy because she's crazy enough to think that she had control over her son that didn't work now she's trying to control elizabeth and elizabeth is not that type of woman that's going to be controlled like she has her own mind she thinks for herself like it's not going to be going the way that she thinks okay not only that she got people spying on elizabeth inside of the castle things of that nature like her helpers and things like that so she really don't know who to trust but on top of that they have revolutionaries that's hitting inside the castle because they're trying to overthrow the government since they are the kings and the queens there so they got crazy people up in there that's also trying to blow up the castle okay so it's just a lot going on like i said if you like shows like bridgerton but this here is like times 10 you know so this is kind of like elizabeth does kind of spiral a little bit because it's a lot going on and then so also she has to meet france's brother and france's brother is so jealous that he has love he's going to be the king and he's just like why she didn't choose me to be the king you know so he's going behind his brother back trying to steal his girl manipulating her things of that nature all because he wants some attention it's not because he deserves it it's because he wants the attention on him now i have some questions for elizabeth like is it worth it okay at the end of the season one change the game she put herself in the right position and i'm wondering how she's going to play her cards okay if you know what i'm talking about you know what i'm talking about just comment below but if you don't you're gonna have to see it for yourself because i'm telling you you're gonna be like this show is wild it's addicting and you just can't help but to binge watch it in one day because i watched this show in one day i stay home all weekend and watch this show and i have no regrets so what do you guys think of this season are you excited to watch season two like i am i'll see you guys in the next video bye